Yes! Oh, hey, how's it going? Yo, so last time we um, did... What did we do? We did vibe. Yeah, the vibe. Vibe was Easter. Yo, what a time. And look, a lot of you gave me some other numbers and I actually added it to the playlist because I did actually forget it because yo, there's, there's a clone people who contributed after this and said like, yo, and it, look, it started a liquor conversation and it was liquor fun and um, I'm glad that we all can agree that we enjoyed vibe and yo, what a, what a liquor time it was. But today, people also requested um, I was to dark side. So we are at dark side. Yo, okay, I must do Dockside now because I want to go to the next ones and I want to go up from where we went. So Dockside and Vibe Matinees was around that time because we actually could only go to Matinees that time still. Um, and it was kind of funny because when you first start going, well, at least for me, my parents were strict and stuff. So you have to go and then you must say like, look here, I'm just going to go to Canal with your friends and stuff. But then now you eat a yak inside Canal, but then you also see other man that's loving there. Also told the parents to drop them off. But the worst thing is when you, you come back now, your parents was fetch you like you had to come home. How was the movie? Now the movie was quiet. What did you see? They said, like, nah, uh, I think Inspector Gadget was playing or something. But you also saw not. And said, now nah, why you wet? Now nah, it's 3D. But yeah, I'm into it. We were at the, the phone party. Now I mean, they were raving, raving. <laughs> In the phone, just slapping. Sure. And the raving was the main thing. The moxing. The moxing was the main thing. I'm going to say it. I was a moxer, I was a raver, I still enjoy that shit, yeah. Um, but yeah, I'll, let's talk about more stuff, Scott, but um, obviously I spoke to a lot of people because look at this list, is going to be contentious. And it's going to be long again, but um, yeah, I'm going to try and keep it sh as much short as possible. But I uh, consulted like my brother Paul and Tim was also, also massive, massive toxic dudes. And me and my friends were toxic copper. We used to love going to rave there. And yeah, we just drink our Fanta and we're having a lick of time. We didn't have the glycerin, the glycerin. Look here, part of the brass did have moose spikes, but not that moose spikes. I never saw it Owen said touching the ceiling. So that was was main. I used to try, I love it there. Rubbing soap there. Maybe it didn't work. I don't know how to do it. If there's a dedication of time, of effort, maybe you had a man with you to help make you set it. Now the stalactite or stalactite is looking liquor, she's brother. But yeah, just to go through that is hectic. And look at the people used to have attention to detail. You see a man in a doctor's mask, he came straight out the Constantia bug, he could fucking did a ladder neck to me, whatever the fuck. And now he's in Dockside raving in the scrubs. <laughs> we went through the effort, baby. We went to action cricket and we stole the white gloves just so we can be quiet there, just like moving around. <laughs> so the other hands is going. Now you see me. Yeah, sis. Well, that's crazy. Just a matter of effort. And then there's cages. There's cages in Dockside. And there's, there's like me just starting in cages. <laughs> oh my word. It's just, it's just wild. It's wild. But um, yeah, I'm going to do my top 10 again. And um, it's not going to be in any order. I will say like maybe this one is the one. But this list is going to be long. And lots of people going to have things to say about it. But um I like that, but also check out the playlist because I think maybe if, if, it's in my, if my top 10 is in your top 10, that's cool. But also check out maybe yours is going to be in it. And I probably think that there will be some in there because all of them could be ones to 10s or you know what I mean. And just shout out like all the money that was DJ. Like DJ Aiden was there. Um, Shalto was obviously there. Nicky Lauda, Fast Eddie. Obviously Eddie D used to be there as well when he used to stick out. But also, I wasn't ever really in the jazz cafe. I'm just gonna say that now. It's always the main dance floor, G and G Pro and whatnot. But yeah, let's start off, and um, I'm gonna start with one of my top tens. And again, this is mine, and I'm gonna go through it. Okay, cool. Baby wants to ride. Now I'm also gonna go forward, forward into the song because it's gonna be obviously long song. Some of them.
What a start, no. Yo, we lost. Just don't tell me. We lost you, yeah. I knew baby wants to die. Yo, that is so insane. <laughs> I remember now. So, before we used to go to a dark side, no. And we used to, either we would be drinking soccer at the district, and then we'll come home, we'll shower and stuff, and we'll meet up, and we'll go through in a taxi again, <laughs> or in a, a friend's top is Bucky, maybe my top most of the time. Um, but then we used to practice. So it's slamming in my room, and then it's like everybody's just slapping, and it's just mooring, you know, everybody thing is going. Now, you lamb and then you're clopping it, and everything. Now your mommy won't pass it. Hey, Simon, what's going on? Say, now let me just listen to music. Come on, mom, get off my back. <laughs> um, and I said, no, but that's the devil's music. Yes, yes. And we were just having fun and raving. And it was, we were stupid, actually. <laughs> but it was, it was fun, man. It was a liquor time just to do that. Yeah, but what a start. Honey, baby, wants to ride. Yes, yes. Um, next up, uh, again, these are all my favorites. But I'm going to, yeah. Let's go with um, another strong one for me. Yo, songs no, <laughs> my bro. Yo, that's that's a killer drop. You can't you can't say anything beside that. That is just amazing. Yes, sis. Um, let's let's actually switch it up. Let's go with some vocally. Look, it is very important to be an aggressive raver, no? but you also have to be the, the sensual raver, and then you know the, the vocal ones come out, and you're all like, you know, you're moving like Dalsim on Street Fighter. I'm all alone in bed, and I can't sleep, I'm feeling blue. I try to close my eyes, but all Also, no, it's the hard, the hard numbers, no, and then this is the vocal review. And look at Didi Forever could easily be number one. But again, I'm just gonna play it in any order. I'm just gonna like say it in like maybe which one it is. But I remember this time now. now it was a bit empty. It was getting full. But now it's kranga <laughs> going to the kranga. But everybody's around and. I was very, I was, I was an aggressive raver, so I used to have, use my arms and, you know, you, you're breaking your back and you're just, you're slapping and everything is going across. And then I went so back, and I was to do the Matrix move, and then I slapped back, so, and I hit this girl, you see, like my back, you know, of my arm by mistake, and she was also raving, and then, I don't know, and the splitty girls, <laughs> and I just slapped back, so, and then I went to the process, like, what the, she's like, Hey, what happened? You throw me away, hit me, and I'm like, nah, sorry, man. I was raving. 
Oh, wait. It's terrible. Obviously, the brass is laughing and the people's upset. Like, what the hell? This group of girls is raving along. Everyone's having a great time. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's a top song, of course. Um, I'm just obviously giving just like memories of being there and stuff. <laughs> Shit, sis. Okay, let's, let's, stay, let's stay with some vocal stuff. Also could have been number one. Be number one, can't stop that number. You can't stop it. You can't stop it. That's a fucking balter. Sure. Um, another look at this is a favorite. This this is a favorite. Again, I always like the odd ones as well. That gives it away. Mad song. You can't stray. Mad, mad song. Yes, sis. Oh my word. Um, again, now two are probably the most iconic is coming back to back. And I will have to, I'm just gonna get into it. What, what an iconic one.
Yo, you can't name a more iconic song than Storm Time to Burn. It's part of this list, actually. Storm Time to Burn is one of the biggest Dark Side songs for me. Completely. I can't think about Dark Side without thinking about Storm Time to Burn. It's one of the biggest ones that have ever been there. At least for me again. But I, I, I think you will have to agree there. Storm Time to Burn was insane. And I followed up again with probably, I'd say like my favorite favorite, but not my number one. I can't say it. I know it's conflicting. Shauna, listen. Now this song is so important uh, because Dark Side used to go so dark now. And the bass there was obviously insane. And when you hear Shauna listen, then it's... And that and the whole place was shaking and that bass, it was something else. And that's why I always grand Jonah listen. Now it goes silent. And the lights is all like, you know, that, that thing. Touching the lights. <laughs> Shh. Be quiet. I love Jonah Listen. Well, it's actually Listen, but yeah, a, a top, top one for me as well. Um, back to back, Storm Time to Burn and Jonah Listen, two of my favorite songs. And honestly, there's this one day now in Dockside, and my brapo will attest to this because we were both there and we were loving that. All you heard was. Then it, then it, they mixed Storm and Jonah together to make this perfect yeses. And obviously, we were losing our minds because who could, who's so creative? <laughs> it's called DJing, man. Um, yeah, it was it Easter that mix. I must say that I did really, I got like it's just a quiet memory there and our reaction then because we had so much fun. Just battling there. And not just battling at Dockside. At the carnival, there used to be a jokeful flavor. And the sweat used to, to drip down off the ceilings there. And your mommy is there by, by the, the elephant normal getting books. And people's having in garpies. And then you're still too young. You're loving it flavor. Loving it cool there. And you now you've been practicing in Dockside. And you come in there and you say, Oh, there's a normist man. There's a Livingston man. So there, salute, salute. And normist come off and then obviously now you have to get in but also you have to impress the brasses so you must also you must mox and you must come in the middle of the ekram but they mustn't also get offended and you you can't like take their heart out and you know and you hold it and you eat it you must do like a, a slow one you must do the, either do like the tolly one and you pull the tolly like, <laughs> and you laugh but then you must let them win and then like do the and then the head most flops down yeah some heavy <laughs> the oats is to go and then your brass is like oh yeah you slap him you slap him it was, you know what it was? It was um, expression of dance. What's it called now? You know, it's, it's the beginning of so I think you can dance. These are artists, you see. They moxing and cutting of copper and whatnot now. That is a form of art. You must realize that they came up with dance moves. They rehearsed and they said, this is a move. 
So I went to my take the balls and I throw it and I kick it like a soccer ball away. And then my master thought about the fact that you know what I'm going to do today. I'm going to take this man's cup off and I'm going to scoop it. Yes, that will be mood. That will be bang. And then man, whoever he is, thank you, sir. You are a legend. Anyways, let's go on. Um, definitely again, let's do some vocal again. Great song, a top song as well. Can't deny the fact that Let's Go Something is obviously one of the top songs you'll have heard there completely. Yo. So just moving along to the next one, obviously a big, big song. You can't know Dark Side without knowing Mario, Ricardo, Komodo. The lights will sink to this normal. But the thing is also you know, that in the rave songs, there's different climaxes now. No? So when you're in the mox and you're in the rave, you can't also use your main rave at the, at the beginning. Because if you use it at the beginning, you have to have something bigger planned or something. And if your friend said, but how come he's using his main rave right now? Maybe he got something planned. And you know, you used to get that, you start your main rave and you, you burn it in it. And the friends like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But then, if they see they come out too early, then they know you spent, you spent. And they say, now you're having an off day. Now nah, come. They're being sure, they're being sure, they're being sure. Just, it's not, sometimes it's not in the game, man, you see. And, um, yeah, so you, as you pace through the song, you get to the big one at the end. And then everybody gets a chance. Everybody gets a chance. And if someone was in the current last, guys, last um, song, then they must wait until the next time so they can also extend their arms a bit. Um, but give everybody a chance and everybody in an orderly fashion as well. And, and you, Michael Jackson. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, Komodo, crazy. <laughs>
most important part of the song is Save our souls. Song, crazy video, but yo, um, this when it came out and the lights and everything was going, it's a build up slot. Everybody's singing the it's it was like, yo, oh, it doesn't matter. It was, it was such a, a fun thing to experience because we were all just like, you know, standard, standard eight grade 10, I'd say that. But I was thinking, like, for me, you know, if you, I'm gonna say 985, but 86. Look, okay, at best, 1988, you have to be around it. If you're 89 and older, I don't know if you saw in Dark Side, eh? Because, yeah, maybe, yeah, 88, I don't know. You can agree with me, but 1988, that's the cutoff. I know how old I am, and I'm old. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to face you. Um, cool, so let's just move along. Oh, my word. Um... Let's hit it with a fucking massive track. Combination, combination. That is as iconic as it gets as well for Darkside. You can't not hear that if you are there at the matinee on that day. It is, it is one of those songs that is that you you. It's like um, it's like a checkpoint in the Amazing Race. But the Amazing Race was Darkside, and hearing that song was a checkpoint. <laughs> yeah, a um, top song, yo. Um. Let's let's move along as well. Just so you know, the War Brothers could have been number one for me. Could have been number one because of this.
it's time for the final dance. And we will be back here again once more to listen to and feel the uplifting sounds of our favorite DJs, the Warp Brothers. We will survive. at the end of the day but getting that, that that drop is one of these most insane drops again another crazy video there's people are compiling this and putting the lady in the songs over videos are crazy now we're just seeing jets and stuff i think we saw um starship troopers here for a bit here as well crazy but yo constantly a, a crazy song but like now it's gonna be a stupid heavier because i'm gonna finish off and i obviously wanna you know put in my numbers like Let's go. Jamma! Another endurance song.
again, endurance song. If you're going in for that, be ready. Know that you're stretched. Your legs is nice. Your arms is nice. You were doing this before. Because sometimes you come to eat paper because it's after soccer. But nah, if you're going to jump in for Slammer Jammer. <coughs> I have my coffee just from doing that. But if you're jumping in for, for Slammer Jammer, no? be ready, be ready, be fit. And take it on because if you fail, everyone's going to be upset with you because they know that is that number. Yes, yes. But yeah, coming to an end now, and it's a vocal mixed with a, um, a, a, a nice and hard one. It's actually a, a mix, I'd say. It's a Paul Van Dyke Russell live in atmosphere. Maybe I'll do an atmosphere one piece or so as well. But um, it's versus um, Lava. <laughs> song that song honestly used to just go through and we you heard that song everywhere lost their minds as well but i'm gonna have to finish it there but actually i'm gonna throw in one more just because i need to actually throw it in it is the iconic kylie minogue rank one you will have never guys i think it's a good spot to sort of finish If you can sing all the words
Ja! Ja! It's such a lekker thing to be taken back there as well. But yo, uh, it's just now, boy. But um, yo, check out the playlist also. I know you're going to disagree, but this is just about my stuff. There's like Robert Miles is there, The Rude is there. There's Fat Bass from War Brothers. There's a whole list now. And if I have most anything, just bass me as well. Um, obviously, like Dooms Night, everything. Don't worry. I know, I know, I've been there. But I just need to go through some of the ones that I've grand, grand as well. But yeah. Uh, salute. If you want to see more of these types of things again, I know this video is actually not going to be shorter than the last video because it's freak long already. But everybody keep liquor and uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. Check out the playlist.